I get a ride on the elevator. This is going to be 63 car. Okay. 25,000 capacity freight car. 25,000? Yep. It lists all the merchandise in and out of Macy's Hell Square. Oh, wow. It has front and rear openings. How far does this travel? This travels to the sub, the sub base to the 11th floor, 11 stories. All right. Can we take a ride? Yes, if you like. Yeah. Bob, so, you want to stay here? Yeah. Just yeah. let that guy know if he wants. I took his elevator. I'll be right back. Right. Yeah, okay. Cool. Andrew, you want us to video you on a handle? Yeah, sure, I'd love that. Great idea. Here, take right. the camera. Who's the camera? Who's the camera person? Take the camera and video me on the car switch. Okay. What am I doing? I'm gonna take Just video me. Oh, okay. On the car switch. Do I, is it on? Dave, can he drive? Is it on Wait, right now? Second. Okay. You start the, yeah, it's recording. It's recording, okay. Can you see me? I uh, sure can. Hey, all yours. All right. Start off, I guess, by going down to the bottom. No, go up first. All right, going go up. up. Go to the bottom. Stay away from the bottom. Here we go. There's water in the pit, always in these cups. Okay. Andrew, you're doing an amazing job. This is an amazing elevator. The noise you hear in the pit is skids. There's water always in the pit, so I got to leave skids down there. If the limits open up, or something opens up, I got to climb on the skids. They can't, get, they can't get any sumps down. They tried thousands and thousands of times. Really? Right now, we just gave a proposal for water damage to replace the office in the pit there for five years. What do you think? This is awesome. Yeah, it's an underground street. Isn't that amazing? People would ever Well, this is an old building. This is from the 1800s. Yeah. They could never get rid of the water. That's right. Been here since I've been here. Is that the original machinery, too? It's all original equipment. So, you know, Thompson, a really logic controller. Wow. It's got MV4s on top of the car with a select, auto select thing. Nice. They just send to the handle. Just let the handle go in the system. It'll self level. Yes, sir. So, is this the top one? No, this is six. We'll keep you away from the top floor because you didn't sign in, so they don't want you going throughout the building. They'll okay. stop us. Because right. you go down. Go back down? If you want a grand tour of the whole building, I have to sign you in. Oh, no, I just want to see the elevator. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> I want to see the equipment. I want to see the equipment, too. The motor room? Yeah. Oh, cool. So how, how old is this? Uh, this, this one here is 1957, this car. It's in the 50s, this elevator. Okay. Now, let me see it's not one camera. of the oldest ones, but I have one with the uh, brushes still in the car here. That's 55. This is a big old. and beautiful oh, old elevator. 1927? Yes, 27. It's running? Yeah, it runs. I just put it back to service today. You can see that? Here's yeah, the controller. Control. Andrew, you want to see a car from 1927? That would be awesome. Okay. That's what we're going to do. No, they'll skip it this trip. <laughs> <laughs> There's the air conditioning in the elevator right yeah. there. Yeah. What floor are we stopping at? Uh, platform. All right. How many more floors These am I going down? Been. Just added on. Because right now Macy's is doing the biggest renovation they've did before. And they're standing some full of time. One and a half? One and a half and two of all two floors. Oh, cool. Okay, release your handle, please. All right, now watch. It's going to self-level. See, this is a self-leveling elevator. Want to see something really cool? Yeah. I got an elevator with leveling tubes. You know tubes that we put in TVs? The back of the day, we used to use the tubes to make the TVs light up. Oh, and have cool. them on top of a loving loon for an elevator. Awesome. So here we are back at the platform. Again, this is an amazing elevator. What is this, 20,000? What, what's the capacity again? 25,000. 25,000 pound traction overhead drive? Overhead traction machine. Cool. That was awesome. That was Sure. All right. Coming? Oh yeah. I thought we were waiting for the other one. <coughs> we couldn't get the other car, but we're going up in this one right now. This used to have the same handle, and now it doesn't. We converted it over. So how old is this one? This one here is the same as that one. It's about 1957. This has jumbo rails. This car here, actually the rails are so bold, you feel the car bounce around because the building, since it's so old, it shifted the rails. You know when a building gets so old, it settles? It settles, yeah. My house is doing that. 
This is a long way up. 19 floors. This is the tallest freight elevator I've ever been on. This one here is 6,000 pounds of test. What are we traveling? 200 feet per minute? 250. Yeah. Uh, he actually had to slow this car. He had to slow this car down because of the way the rails are so bowed in the shaft way. That's nice. It's running all right. It's oh, it runs nice. nice. Yeah. Which you see, which you see the control. Oh, yeah. Huh? You slide? You slide mm -hmm. shoes on you? Yeah, regular shoes, car shoes, jumbos. Yeah. Here we are up at 19. This one's not self-leveling, is it? Nope. These all have music boxes on top. They don't have to have one final limit to share, and the rest of the limits are in a music box. We travel with Swatch the fall. Swatches step here. Okay. okay, well, four or five. Swatches. Up. Now here we are, 19 stories up. Oh, look at that, 50, this is 57 elevator. Car 57. Oh, this has it. Okay. Oh, Stop. Cool. Open the gate. All right. Before he goes. Okay, this is 57. To oh. This is another freight that we have in Macy's that has leveling tubes. All right. 1927. What is a leveling? Can you shine a light on it? Awesome. It's a tube that they used to use back in the day to complete circuits for like television. It's like a vacuum tube, right? Stuff. Yep. That's what this car has. Right? Leveling tubes. It doesn't have a leveling tape like the new units. Like that over there. You see that? That's a leveling tape. That's yep. what they call an IP3300 stops on magnets. This one here stops on a vein. That vein's in the shaft, yeah. and when you hit those tubes, they glow and stop the elevator. Oh, cool. There's the alarm bell. Look at the road. So how old is all this, this technology? This one here is from 1927, all this stuff on top of the car. Wow. And this is all like original. original all original. Stuff. Yep, that's awesome. All original. All right, Bobby, close the gate up. Sure. In the clear. Come on up. What's the maintenance like? Here comes the car back up. Well, we're in here, me and him, we take care of the whole building. Yeah. We do repair elevators and escalators. So we try to get to two to three cars per day, call it tops and pits, but it's hard. And there he's back up. elevator machine room, never do so without an escort and always have proper PPE on. This is the 1950 vintage. DC to DC to regulate. I put my own light bulbs on to say when the game the doors are closed, so oh, cool. I don't know they shut down. These are called dampening motors. They help break down the DC to quite a level. And there's the car moving right there. This is a geared traction. Double brake. We call it a <coughs> What's the capacity on this car? 4,000 pounds. This is a car switch, right? Yep. It's got three brothers. It's got 58, 57. Very leveled and the brake went on. Hear that? DC. Everything is DC. That's the motor generator, right? DC to DC generator. This is your DC main line. This whole back freight car. So that's the cutoff switches, right? Yep, all the main lines. To kill you the, open those and the power closes. up. Yes, sir. Beautiful gurney equipment. These are all generators. These are Otis. I have a coupling in the middle, DC to DC. But a coupling. You don't, you don't see this anymore. Oh wow, look at that. Instead of having a metal coupling, I have like a flat tire. That's the motor side that moves the generator. This is the generator that cranks out. It's got an overspeed on it. So if the, the thing ever goes suicide, you step out, starts overspeeding, uh -huh. it automatically trips it, it yeah. shuts the generator off. That's cool. Otis? These are the controllers. These are DC, DC and Otis. Is that the selector? This is the old high selector, yes. So is it still in use? These cars, no. So what cars are these right here? That's 50. This is 55. That's the one we want to ride. And 56. That's what the we, gearless machine. This is the car we came up on right here, right? Yeah. This is the motor on the car that we came up on, an old freight elevator. There's a 
brakes set. Should I run the car back down? Cool, and here we are back in the elevator. I want to copy this video. It'll be up on YouTube, definitely. Can you film me driving the elevator? I sure can. Minus that one part. Yeah. Otherwise, I'll be looking for a drop right. from you. You let me spin. Going down. I go to ten. I'll show you that ABC. Ten. Here we go. I'm gonna be. All right. Gate I'll, be I'll be answering by the. Uh, Here we go. Here we go. Ten. Frank will be answering to me too. No, so it reduced speed a little yeah, bit after we, starting uh, just up. Awarded, I was throwing, uh, that you were 100 yeah, yeah. years old, you have oh. reduced speed too? No. <laughs> I'm 37 years old and no, I've had to reduce speed already. No. This is not self life but it really requires the, super, the supervisors to follow up with the guys. Well, but ultimately, ultimately, yeah. it's my man. Well, you know. Like I was telling him, I got two shirts here. Uh, getting you what you need is not a problem. I just want to make sure that Frank is going to be responsive and get you in a timely fashion. That's all. How are we doing? Perfect. Doing. I'm having a great time. So uh, tell me a little bit about this uh, this sure we uh, crank sure here. What's the uh, uh, He's very he, dedicated. He's uh, he's, he's zoned me out. Of it. He's already learned to zone me out. Okay. Uh, I got to talk to you about uniforms. I'm all, I got problems. I, I'm trying to Let keep everybody running. Elevator. Customers happy and things rolling. You're getting the, you're getting the floor yeah. 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 You understand? Corporate. I guess we're close yeah. enough. How do we do? We'll see when he opens the doors. Oh, ah. Pretty close. So you nailed it. Yeah, all right, you're hired. Put the side of the door. Do I need my safety glasses on anymore? No, you're good. Okay, cool. We're going to get to see an ABC elevator. Nobody, how are you? ABC, this is for you. This is my first ABC elevator ever. And we're going to take this thing on a ride. This is your original call handle. Oh, it's CJ Anderson. Tom, that's yours. Tom's CJ Anderson car station. Let's take this thing on a ride. Give me two minutes. I'll be right back. We'll be right back. Oh, this is car 54. This is the ABC you were just upstairs for. All right. This is called the engineer elevator. So which way do I want to go first? Go up and down, whatever floats your I'll boat. go all the way down, then all the way up. Here we go. This is called the engine. I just have to have a key. All right, he has to turn it on. All right, here we go now. Wow. Oh. Stop at the third floor. I'm going to go Okay, I will stop at three. Seven, is this self-leveling? No, this is not a self-level law either. Okay, so I have to... It'll, it'll yeah, just stop when I tell it to stop, right? It's variable speed. Oh, cool, you can slow it down nice and smooth. Cool, yeah. this is variable speed. Meaning you can start it up nice and gently, go into full throttle, and up you go. Now this is an elevator. This is an ABC elevator. We saw the machine upstairs. Now going down, we'll listen to the mechanics and be quiet. Let me stop back at 10. All right. Good. Was it at 10? Yeah, you want to pass this? Hold it down. Okay. Stop. This one here is 1927. If you look, this is the old emergency lighting. It's a lantern. Oh, wow. Wow, that's pretty cool. And that's the old intercom system for when people got stuck in the elevator. Let me get a view of this cab before we go down. There's the camera up there. This is an old elevator. What year is this from? 1927. And look at that. C.J. Anderson, Chicago, Illinois. I know Tom Seibert. Love that. Here's the safety. So now we're going down to 10? Yep. Go back to 10. Please. Watch how smoothly I can start this thing up. Nice. Look, Andrew, you might be hired, Andrew. Come over here on the weekends and run the elevator for them. I think I'm close to the floor. There we are. And here we are at 10. And that is the old ABC. And now we continue our Macy's adventure and we'll take this back down to what floor? Where are we going now? Seven. Go down to seven. Mm -hmm. Center. Do it again. 
it should, there, now it should go. Is that going to handle? Make sure that, you know, all the inner locks are tripped. Now we should go. There we go. Ten. Nine. Oh, I went high overshot. All right, down a little bit. Side of the handle, do it again. This thing's kind of finicky. There we go. Uh. <laughs> See, you fit in good here, I think. Perfect, perfect. <laughs> and I got it right on, look at that. Dead on. Got it dead on. I could be an elevator operator at Macy's right now. Wait a minute, I am one right now. Down to what floor? The operator just fold in out sick. You can have to stay. Yeah. <laughs> no. Are y'all having fun over there? Oh, you uh, words can not describe <laughs> the fun I'm having. This has been quite an adventure. All right, there's the platform next. Yep. Right there? Yes, Okay. Just check. This thing doesn't like to level. <laughs> when the gates open up, sometimes you need to travel down. Release it. Release it. There we go. I think we gotta go up. Oh, you know, perfect. Needs a little perfect. Finesse, yeah. you know? Macy's finesse, they call it. <laughs> There's Macy's finesse right there. Now we're back down on the platform. This is the end of the Macy's part. I don't know.